What's up everybody? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to be trapping for ground squirrels or squirrels, whatever you want to call them. All I know, they live in the ground and that's all I know. So what we're going to be using to trap them is this live trap. I love it. It works great. So first to set it, you got to push this these two, this bar back and it will lock by itself. Then when something steps on that plate in the inside there, for example, something steps on it, it will close and these two bars will keep it from coming out. So, absolutely love the trap, works amazing, and love it. So, to kill the um, ground squirrel, we're going to be using a CO2 part pistol. It is 440 FPS, it has the capacity of 20 bullets. And it's just great. I love it as well. Um, it just gets the job done whenever you need it. Yeah. Fresh goat holes. He's disappearing. You can tell here a lot. There's a trap on here. So, as you can see, the gopher hole is right there. Here's the trap. I'm gonna keep, have like a bit of distance there. So, what I want to do is kind of push this grass a bit up and kind of dig it into it just a bit. And maybe put some on top at the side so it looks a tiny bit more natural and now we should set it so lift it and now we just got to get it hair triggered right there we go get the hair triggered so right at the edge there so it slips off really easily There you go, yeah. There we have it. So, I forgot the peanut butter. I'll be right. Okay, I'm back guys. So we have a stick, we have the peanut butter. What we're gonna do, we're gonna take this stick and we're gonna crack it at the top a little bit. Okay? So, now, we put peanut butter on the longer side of the stick. Let me just do that. What I like to do is just stick it into there. Just give it a second there. And now you squeeze it out as you pull the stick out turn the stick as well so it gets all over the stick oh how beautiful 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 there you go maybe smear it a bit if you need to okay now the peanut butter you stick at the back you put the peanut butter in first like so then you put the other stick in and now it will be hanging in that inside just like that now, when the um, uh, ground squirrel or squirrel uh, will walk into here, he's going to need to stand up to get the, to that peanut butter. But when he like goes back down, he's going to put more weight on that plate, so it makes it easier for it to close. So, one more thing. We're going to take the peanut butter. We're going to put some by the hole, so that it will smell and come out and maybe like a bit here as well. Just so it kind of like gets the scent of the peanut butter in there. So yeah, now we're gonna leave the trap be in there. Hopefully, the ground squirrel will come out of there. We'll trap it, and then yeah, I'll come back when we trap one. Hey guys, I'm very sorry. I deleted the video where 
I found out that we had a squirrel in the trap. It was an accident. But here's the rest of the video. So how we're gonna kill this guy is pretty simple. So make the cage stand up so the door is at the very top. Now what you will do is kind of dangerous. Not really. Well, the squirrel can easily climb out. Like, see, as it just climbed up. So you're gonna open it, stick the gun into there, and you're just gonna shoot him from the top. But when he climbs up, immediately close the door, or else he could bite you or escape. Yeah. So I'm just quickly gonna do that. I won't do it on camera because I don't want to get like demonetized or anything. Yeah. So I'll be right back. 17 or 13 striped squirrel. I forgot the actual name. But yeah, that is the squirrel. It's pretty nice. I'm gonna be tanning this guy, and I'm gonna be yeah. For also first I gotta skin it. Skin's like a normal squirrel. You start by the legs, cut all the way down there, cut the tail off, then you cut down the belly, all the way down. Then you cut out the, these arms. Well, you can cut it off by the head, the skin, or you can get the whole skin on the head as well. I don't know what I'll do. I think I might do without the head. So, yeah. 